Now let's shift focus to Ogun State, where the state government has expressed fear that maternal mortality may increase in the state as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. In order to avert the imminent occurrence, the government has commissioned a state-of-the-art clinical skills laboratory at the School of Midwifery Federal Medical Center, Biokuta, to train skilled and professional midwives in the state. The skills lab is equipped with modern infrastructure to facilitate learning and keep the midwifery students abreast of current trends in maternal and child health. Commissioning the facility, wife of the state governor, Bamidela Biodo, explained that the clinical skills lab would stimulate the clinical activities of students in that field in the state as well as reduce the risks of students of contracting COVID-19 pandemic during the period of clinical experience. The skills laboratory is equipped with modern infrastructure. You see what we saw in the To facilitate learning and keep the midwifery students abreast of the current trends in maternal and child health, especially in the field of obstetrics and gynecology, in line with global best practices. It's one of His Excellency Prince Lagwadiyo's investment in maternal and child health aimed at reducing maternal mortality in Ogun State by 25% by the end of the year 2022. On her part, the Commissioner for Health, Dr. Tomi Kuka, described the government's gesture as a capacity-building intervention, adding that the intentions of the state governor, Dr. Biodu, is to have quality health care de delivered in an affordable and accessible primary health care centers. So with the collaboration of the UNFPA, we've been able to revamp the skills lab buy mannequins that would simulate the real um, scenario so that our midwives, when they qualified and leave, we can immediately engage them in the service of women, knowing that they have the right skill to ensure the safe delivery of mother and baby without harm. So that is how that would impact. The ultimate um, result, outcome, would be a reduction in a maternal and child health mortality in Ogun State, which at the moment stands, stands at 179 per 100,000. And now away from health matters. The